Hello guys, welcome back to Serial File with me, Sam. Today we're going to be trying out Frosted Flakes cereals, uh, more specifically Marshmallow Frosted Flakes. Um, we have the new, I think they're new, um, Frosted Flakes with marshmallows and the quite old <laughs> uh, chocolate Frosted Flakes with marshmallows. These I bought here in Mexico, therefore you can see the name is in Spanish, Sucaritas. And we have Tigre Toño. Over here we've got Tony the Tiger. So we're gonna be having a Mexican and American cereal today. <laughs> um, I brought these like regular Frosted Flakes in a mini version just so we could have the box here, but I'm not gonna be trying those out because if we have them with marshmallows, we'll go for marshmallows, definitely. Uh, you can also see here it's Sucaritas, <laughs> the name in Spanish. So we are gonna try out these first. Um, I think I've never had Frosted Flakes with marshmallows, so I am excited about these. And also I was checking out that they do have like special marshmallows because the chocolate version doesn't it's just like little white marshmallows with no shapes hmm. they used to have shapes i remember these having uh different colors and shapes they had a baseball bat a basketball mm, i'm not quite sure what other shapes they had i think they had a football yeah and i'm not sure if the other one was a baseball or something but they used to have shapes and now they're just little white marshmallows so these are supposed to have um, yeah on the side we have a power paw a scarf oh Tony's red scarf um, a sweet swirl whatever that is <laughs> and a Tony the Tiger shape Kind of. So we'll see if that's true. I pre-opened the cereal bag. Yay, I did. So, oh, you know what? Let me get the marshmallows out now if I can. I'm just missing the Tony one. Oh, okay. What I am noticing is that they are not as frosted as I remember them, like the cereal or the flakes. Let me show you the, whoops. <laughs> Let me show you the marshmallows first. Um, we can see them here and on the side. Um, well, you know, marshmallows are never quite as pretty as the box shows them. So yeah, I don't really see those shapes. But guys, I think I am gonna open the Oh, oh, nice marshmallows. One, of, probably one of the best that I've tried. Um, I am gonna open the the box, the mini box of frosted flakes because I do want to compare the flakes. You can see these here; they're not as frosted, and I don't know if it's a uh, like this cereal specifically, the marshmallow one or a Mexico thing, but I'm pretty sure flakes here are super frosted, or at least in comparison, I do see them more frosted. I don't know, like you don't see much sugar on these, but these are completely covered in a shiny sugar, I don't know. <laughs> shiny sugar cover i'm not sure <laughs> what to call it but they do look frostier here so i'll just mix them it's okay <laughs> all right so after making a mess here do you want one flake there you go uh let's try these because they do look adorable and those marshmallows that i just tried wow seriously wow <laughs> so let's try these they look great mm. 
They look great. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it tastes. Mm -hmm. Pretty good. Mm, like I said, not very frosted, but the marshmallows, wow, they're amazing. So it gives it a great, great flavor. Mm. <laughs> okay. Mm. I have to say my expectations were very, very low um before eating this just because it was or it is sorry uh kellogg's cereal and my experience with kellogg's cereals that add marshmallows to them is not great because they don't always add enough marshmallows i think or the marshmallows are just like eh. but i have to say these marshmallows are awesome i love them and the amount of marshmallows was perfect. It was really, really good. I got marshmallows in every bite. So I really did enjoy Frosted Flakes with marshmallows. Um, I have to say, I would have liked it more if they were more frosted. Um, like I showed you, these are completely covered in sugar. Well, you even have like a lot of sugar in the bottom of the, of the bag. So yeah, I know Frosted Flakes to be like super, super sweet. These are super sweet, completely covered, completely frosted. And these unfortunately felt like, um, like corn flakes, you know, like just not, not as frosted as I would have liked them to be. Oh, and they're also super thin. I hadn't noticed how thin these flakes are in comparison to these. It might be like the extra frosting <laughs> of these that make them crunchier or harder. But I actually do like the texture of these because they're so thin. So they're super easy to chew on. Hmm. Okay, well guys, um, I'm gonna say flavor. I will be giving it a nine just because of the frosted flakes. They should have more frosting on them more 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 sugar please okay so that's the only reason i'm giving this a nine in flavor i really loved the marshmallow flavor um texture i really like it of course they get soggy they definitely do they are flakes they will get soggy so um i'll give it a nine but it does have a good texture marshmallows have an amazing texture they're just perfect marshmallows. Okay, and um, the presentation, I think it's really pretty. I do have to say that the marshmallows don't really look <laughs> like the ones, even though the ones on the picture are not that amazingly shaped, they don't look like it anyway. And um, also, also about the presentation, well, I think they, they could have made the the marshmallows more colorful right i mean like having the orange tony and then the oh but it's a paw i'm sorry i was thinking it was like a flower but no sorry it's his paw it's a power paw so it should be orange i'm sorry yeah well whatever this blue and orange thing was the sweet swirl i guess it just doesn't need so much orange on it. And well, the red scarf, that's pretty cute. I don't know, I wish it were they were more colorful, but uh, presentation, only because of the marshmallow thing, um, I'll give it an eight. Mm -hmm. But pretty good. All right, so we can move on to the chocolate version. Um, I remember, like I mentioned, eating these and having different colors, different shapes of marshmallows. And I also remember this being one of my favorite cereals that I could get here. So I still hope that they taste amazing because chocolate and marshmallows is always a great combo. Um, 
Okay, not as many marshmallows as I remember or would have hoped for, but we definitely do have some there. So we can see marshmallows and chocolate flakes in there. So, I mean, it doesn't look as appealing as it used to, but let's try. Oh gosh. They're super crunchy, like bad crunchy. Mm. Mm. Chocolate is good. Marshmallow's not great. Super hard flakes, what? Oh God, I did not remember that even being an issue, like just hard to chew on at all. Um, and they're not expired <laughs> or anything. So I don't know why, but that was not pleasant at all. Uh, really, really bad texture. Um, flavor, I mean, the chocolate is really good. So I'm going to give it, um, oh, but the marshmallows were, I don't know, too little or few marshmallows in there. Um, I'm going to say flavor uh, an eight. It's a, a good chocolate cereal. Um, it has a good flavor. It just definitely needs more marshmallows to have an amazing flavor because they used to have a lot of marshmallows in there and the flavor was amazing. So they definitely need to do that. I don't know if you can see, but um, there aren't that many marshmallows at all in there. So, oh well. Um, the texture was awful, awful, awful texture. Uh, the flakes too crunchy and the marshmallows are like I don't know very old and soft like these are kind of crunchy marshmallows just amazing texture and these are just like soft old marshmallows so yeah unfortunately I'm gonna have to give texture a, ah, a three <laughs> three spoons for texture um, and for presentation uh, well there's really nothing to to <laughs> check or like the marshmallows like I said are just like little white marshmallows well even even <laughs> the ones here are like really strange not pretty um, the flakes in the picture, they are very chocolatey. In real life, mm, they're not quite as chocolatey. You can see that they're not completely covered in chocolate. So it's not the same presentation that we see on the box. Ah, I'm gonna say mm, a seven for presentation. Okay, so I'm gonna mix them. I really don't wanna put these in. <laughs> And it used to be one of my favorites. So, I mean, even the name, like chocolate frosted flakes with marshmallows, just saying that <gasps> makes my mouth water, but not after this, not after this awful presentation of cereal. Um, so yeah, let's mix these all pretty. Pretty, pretty marshmallows. Okay, so we mixed them. Here they are. And let's try them together. Mm -hmm. Let me make sure I get both. Mm. Mm. These marshmallows make all the difference. Just amazing. Mm. It's a good combination, but these are still like too hard. So 
Hmm. Hmm. Well, it was very interesting to try these out, especially these. I am pleasantly surprised with these and I'll definitely ah, be excited to eat them. So thank you guys so much for watching the video and for joining me in these or in this marshmallow frosted journey. Um, thank you so much. Don't forget to give a thumbs up, subscribe and follow. Thank you guys so much. I'll see you next time. Bye.